Coach. We can start. Okay. Thank you. Hello, everybody. Uh, tomorrow it's first official game for us against Petrolul. Uh, we cannot count on uh, Dennis Politic because of uh, suspension because of yellow cards. Also, uh, Velkovsky, his work permission is uh, still not over and uh, he cannot uh, play. Uh, all other players are uh, ready. Uh, we are motivated. Uh, what I expect from the players to be on the maximum level tomorrow. We respect Petrolul a lot. I know that they have a very good team, that uh, they are a very stable team. They played uh, until now 12 draws, what speak about their stability. Uh, they also have equal goal. Uh, uh, 22 goals they scored and 22 goals they concede what again it's uh, speak enough for uh, themselves and I know that uh, in front of us is very tough game and I know that all players tomorrow have to be good football players but also the Warriors because it will be a game with a lot of duels a lot of intensity, a lot of energy <clears throat> and if we want to get a good result we need to be uh, a, a top team in uh, in these kind of things. Uh, that's it for the beginning. If you have any questions, every said, game will be as a final for Dinamo. For us, every game is important. We have nine and nine, at the moment nine plus nine games, and uh, for uh, every game the preparation will be the same to 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 be on the top. What we can be at this moment. How do you feel the level of confidence around the team? We are good. We are good. Uh, we have we finished uh, the last part of the season with uh, two wins. Uh, with uh, we scored these uh, three goals. Uh, we had two games uh, zero at the back, and for uh, of course this is uh, important for the for the team, for players, for all of us. You said the Politic and Belkovski won't play tomorrow, but all the other players will be ready. Should we expect to see Pavicic or Nevo or Niaure tomorrow? Uh, Okay, we will see about the, the minutes. All players what we have signed, they, they, they have quality for sure, and this is why we signed them. But of course, they have uh, some problems. Most of them uh, uh, didn't play for a while. Uh, also, they didn't go through preseason uh, with us. But I know what is the, the, their situation now, and we will. Uh, uh, make individual approach for all of them. Eddie, he played the uh, last game in December. Uh, he's in a little bit better situation from this uh, part than uh, other players, but he arrived uh, in Bucharest today and we will see until until tomorrow how will be situation with him as well. Did you expect more players to come? Okay, we, we already signed a few players. Uh, I told you several times that uh, we are working on the transfers, that we, we are analyzing the market and it's very, very tough to sign the player in this uh, winter transfer window, but I think that we did a good job and week by week that we'll, we will be better and better and this is important for all other uh, things or uh, other players, uh, we will see until the end of the transfer period. But in the same time, how hard it is to uh, find a new striker? What I said? I guess you yeah. need one. Uh, I said you a few times that I'm, I respect all my players what I have in the team and I don't want to speak about any players which we didn't sign and about any position we are looking for. We were looking for uh, positions in uh, every line. We have our ideas and we work on that. In this moment, uh, it's a problem with the number of foreign players in the team. Yeah. Are there chances uh, for some players to leave also? Yes. Uh, this is, uh, for me, it's tough decisions because I really have respect about uh, all players in the team and uh, if somebody will go. It's it's not easy for me to make these kind of decisions because I feel them like good players, like good personalities, like uh, professionals. And But I have to make what is the best for the team and for the club and uh, that's it we will manage.
All the fans are expecting for the results. Uh, do you have a message for the fans? Yeah, it's always the same. We will fight. We will fight for everything. Of course, we have to expect that some sometimes we'll be, we will play better football. Sometimes we will have problems, but uh, we work hard. We analyzing our opponent. Uh, we 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 will be ready to to be on our maximum. It's any player from Petrolu where it's uh, I have maybe dangerous. They have few dangerous players and uh, two strikers are uh, very good. Okay, it depends which formation they, they will play tomorrow. They usually play 3-5-2, but they also tried in uh, pre-season camp this 4-1-4-1 formation and uh, we will see, but uh, it's up to us to, to, to be ready for uh, every situation uh, on the pitch and whatever Petrol will we do, how they will start, which formation we need to, to be on the level to, to understand what they want to play and to have proper answer for everything. You are a very experienced uh, coach. What's the most important thing in this fight, avoiding the relegation? The most important thing for you and the players? Everything. Everything is important. Uh, mental preparation to be ready to fight. Uh, also to have this mental stability in the situation when it's tough to not lose our way and uh, tactical uh, part, uh, fitness part, we, we are, it wasn't a long period of pre-season but we work uh, good and we need to continue with that and uh, one game will not make a difference but we need to be ready for every single game and uh, every detail it will be important because we need to we are still uh, seven, eight points behind these teams and uh, it's not easy, but I believe that we will, uh, at the end of the season, that we will be reason, that we will have a reason to be, to be happy and satisfied. How much time do you think the new players will need to integrate in the squad? I don't know. I don't know. It uh, depends on every individual. I need to fill them. Uh, with these players we have one big plus, which is that this, the quality is obvious, but also I understand that uh, there are some problems because uh, they are not in the, in the uh, on, they don't play on a regular basis for some time. But this is something what I accept, what I understand and uh, I will try with, with my staff to make like some MP3 format, you know, to, to make shortcut to bring them in the best shape as, as fast as uh, we can. If this is true, I don't know if it's official, yeah, it's official. but I'd stop. I think that uh, he was also connected something with Dinamo Zagreb, if I remember last season. Uh, for uh, every single player, like uh, like uh, options like that, it's a top opportunity, and I have to uh, just to say good luck if he will go if he will go there. And this is great job for Rapid as well and for uh, Romanian football. Yes. I think that uh, in the league, it's. Uh, it is quality and uh, day by day, week by week, I hope that uh, the, the games will be good, that quality will be high and that many, many players will have opportunity like this one to, to, to go for the next challenges on even higher level. Thank you, thank you good luck.